The bank established that during the first eight months of 2014, the trade deficit widened further as a result of the higher import bill. The Bank of Namibia Governor Ipumbushimi says this consisted mainly of capital goods, vehicles and other consumer goods. Great household credit continues to be high, you know, making households more indebted. One will have to increase interest rates to contain it. Because first of all, you do not want you know consumption for consumption credit to be used to to make household indebtedness worse because that's a concern. Despite pressure, Shimi was quick to point out that the international reserves remain sufficient to meet the country's foreign obligations. The governor further noted that strong growth in credit to individuals was observed in the categories of overdrafts, other loans advances, and installment credit. The world economy, the Canadian economy, is still in a recovery phase. There are still risks on the horizons. There are sectors such as agriculture that are not doing very well. So when one is increasing interest rates or looking at the monetary policy decision, one will have to take a view. Uh, looking at, at, at both, both sides. It is against this development in the local economy that the Monetary Policy Committee of the Bank of Namibia decided to keep the repo rate unchanged at 6.0% to support domestic economic activities.